Hello guys, the, welcome to my channel, this is the 3D Mark over at Test. It's a new benchmark from Future Mark for the Pro users uh, to benchmark DirectX 12, Mantle and DirectX 11. So since we can't record DirectX 12 or Mantle, because there aren't any software, uh, I had to record this with my smartphone, I'm very sorry for that, but uh, it's what I have. Uh, this is my HG7850, this is my Fanon 2X4 over Coca 23.7. And this benchmark consists in rendering the more draw calls possible. Draw calls are associated to the objects in map, so the more draw calls, the more objects. It's uh, as simple as that. Uh, so we're going to benchmark all the APIs. We're going to start with Mantle. Alright. And uh, as soon as the test reaches 30 frames per second, the test ends and gives you the results. So guys, enjoy the results. So there is a massive advantage of Mantle and DirectX 12 over DirectX 11 and we noticed these improvements before on Star Swarm and the Thief and Battlefield 4 which, were, which was the benchmarks I made before and uh, it's clearly that uh, these draw calls isn't everything so we're gonna notice an improvement if you have uh, low-end CPUs or old CPUs that may be bottlenecking your graphic card you're gonna clearly notice an advantage of your performance but draw calls isn't everything what I mean is that uh, the games have to process too and artificial intelligence and many other things like sounds and things like that that it's a work for the CPU but at least Mantle and DirectX 12 we're gonna sh it's going to help you a lot with the draw calls which is going to be processed with much less effort and it's going to give an headroom for your CPU to process other things so for people that actually have a very good CPU and a very good graphic card and don't have bottleneck DirectX 12 and Mantle may not be the thing that uh, people are saying that it is that it's going to improve a lot maybe it's not going to be like that but people for me that have a fan and a very old cpu and this graphic card the difference is going to be awesome uh, not to mention too that uh, if game starts to take advantage of more vm distance and much more level of details direct direct x12 and mantle will gonna be very very useful comparing to direct x11 like for example assassin's creed unity that render 5k of uh, draw calls 
Drag Tech 12 and Mantle would be great on that game. But that's all guys, hope you enjoyed the video, it's going to be an awesome, it was, it was awesome indeed, and <laughs> this is great, I'm truly waiting for DirectX 12 to be a standard in game, because uh, the CPU, it's already being bad in DirectX 11, so for me, it's all I want for now, and it's, it promises to be a great future for the PC gaming. Guys, thank you a lot for watching, and girls, see you soon.